Wix, WordPress, and Squarespace are not the only websites that we can add IDX to. We can basically add IDX to any type of website. This website right here is a perfect example of that. It was built using a platform called Showit. So Showit is a drag and drop website builder where people create their website by dragging and dropping their content and there's no specific format. They just um, create it however they want um, the website to look. So um, Sweet Home Alabama was created using this platform and we recently added IDX to their website. So the first thing you see when you go on their website is this search bar, which is our regular Omni search bar. Um, this was customized to be a bit bigger than these fields right here. And we also customized this button to be red, match their logo, and this box that is pink is also matching with the rest of their buttons and style. When somebody makes a search, it takes them to this results page and this map right here is scrollable and when you click on a price it shows you the property in this case let's make a specific search in a city and let's see what shows up so these are the properties in Azure. this was also customized um, using the colors of their site as well as this button right here we can customize this using CSS or you can also customize it in our website idxsaddons.com using our IDX Colors app. Let me show you. This is our section IDX Colors and you can change the main, secondary, border and map colors um, using this right here. If somebody clicks on a specific property it will take them to the details page that they decided to use. This is one of our templates that you can get for free by making Realty Candy your developer. It has the property information right here, more details over here, and the price. And then you can click on the properties and scroll through them with these arrows right here. If somebody clicks on new search, it will take them to the advanced search. This is our regular advanced search template and it has um, the colors of their site. When we're adding IDX to your site, we make sure to use colors um, that match the colors that you're already using or if you have suggestions or colors you want us to use, just let us know and give us the color hex code. So this is the advanced search, the basic search, listing ID to search for listing ID numbers, Map search, our maximum map search app with the properties over here at the side. You can click on a property and it will show you where the property is right here. This is one of our coolest features. Finally, the last thing I want to show you is something that most people know, um, but it's not obvious. So I want to explain how lead generation works in IDX Broker. So when somebody makes a search, Let's imagine we just want properties that have three beds and three baths. And we don't care about the city. We just want the quantity of beds and baths. And we want to save this search. We would click on this button if we were um, one of your clients. And then it would ask us to create an account. So if I'm a client and I'm looking for a home and I want to save this search so that I receive updates of these 500 properties that match the search I created, I would need to add my first name, last name, email address, phone number, and sign up. And this way I keep on getting these updates. You can also make more specific searches like choose a specific city, choose more baths, more beds, etc. So if I'm a lead and I create this account, my information will go to IDX Broker. And in this case, I'm using a demo account. So all of these are demo profiles. They're not real leads. But if I were to add in my information here, and this would be your account, I would show up here. So imagine this is me, save your test in my email, and it would say one save search. And if I start saving more save searches while I'm logged into my account, it will add more save searches here. So if you click on save search, you will be able to see what the lead is seeing. So in this case, in the demo account, it's zip code 33146. In my case, it would be three beds, three baths, or whatever the save search is called. And you can also add a save search for any lead. 
So if you want to add a safe search for Myra No Traffic, which is also a bogus account, you would click on here and you would click on add or edit safe searches. All of their safe searches would show up here and if you want to add a new one, you would click here and you can choose a search page like advanced search and then just add in the criteria. So if you want Myra to see only properties in a certain city that have a specific price interval or have a specific number of beds um, listed only 10 days ago, I would create the search over here and click on next step, name it. So properties for Myra and save my search. So success, the search is saved successfully. So this lead will now start getting updates on this safe search that you've created for them. You can find the leads page over at leads and manage, and you can also search for leads over here. So if you're having a hard time finding somebody, you can just type in their name, find them here. So make sure if, if a certain lead doesn't have an account like this one, um, to click on it and create or activate the account for them so that they start receiving updates. This is a really cool feature that IDX Broker has and it helps so that your leads are always receiving properties and finding the homes that they're looking for. Check out all of the services that we offer at realtycandy.com.